Hi guys, it's Crazy Coupons. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, we're going to be talking about surprise penny items. Plus, I'm going to be sharing some penny hauls that you guys sent in. So before we get started, if you haven't already subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting on. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It's right down below this video. And while you're at it, do a really huge favor. Hit that thumbs up button and leave me a smile down in the comment section below because those are two quick, easy, and free ways that y'all can help support this channel. And then take a second to share the video. All right, guys. So first up, just quick for the reminder that I have already uploaded several other DG videos that you might want to go and check out. We've got new coupons, new glitches, run deals, rebates, new clearance markdowns, penny list info, the whole nine yards. So if you missed out on anything, make sure that you go and check it out everything's gonna be linked for you in the pinned comment down below all right guys so let's go ahead and jump right in now this week i did get caught up on all of the emails i think a couple came in last night that i have to get back to but for the most part everything is caught up on the email side and i do want to give a huge shout out and thank you to annette gloria amanda and danny and also Marche, savannah and jodian for sending in deals coupon matchups glitches pictures of your penny hauls surprise pennies that we're going to talk about here in just a second uh, but big shout out and thank you to all those people it really does help me out now while I was answering emails I started to realize that we have a lot of brand new penny shoppers and they have a lot of questions and one of the biggest questions that I received was can you penny shop any day of the week or is this only on Tuesday well good news every single day you can penny shop at Dollar General and there are still tons of penny items out there. And I know that a lot of you guys will remember back in November, we pretty much had the biggest penny list of the year. And then following that, we had a huge surprise penny week where there were just hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of items that surprised pennied out. So there's another little misconception that's going around that I'm gonna clear up in this video, but I wanna go ahead and get started First of all, if you are new to penny shopping, please do not ask the employees about penny items, penny sales, penny lists, etc. We do not ask employees about penny items. That is the number one rule. Here are a few more tips. Scan with the DG app to price check. Make sure you have your correct store location set. If the item shows up at 000 or 001, that means that you have in fact found a penny item. And I have the penny policy posted over on the community tab. All right, guys, now let's go ahead and jump into some surprise pennies. So here we have the collegiate post-it notes and I do want to give a huge shout out and thank you to Jodian for sending in these amazing pictures she found a bunch of these Tennessee and Alabama so whatever state you're in whatever the college sport teams are make sure if you spot these scan them and see if they are a penny in your area because again these are surprise pennies I'm not sure when they pennied out. Jodian is not sure when they pennied out. They have definitely not been on any penny list because I post the penny list here every single week. So surprise guys, if you spot these, make sure that you scan them because your miles may vary. These may not have pennied out for every state, but definitely they are a penny in Tennessee and Alabama. So be on the lookout. Now, another surprise penny that Jodian found was in Alabama roll tide yard flag now unfortunately she gave it away before she took a picture of it but if you guys see any of those collegiate yard flags scan 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 and again huge shout out and thank you to jodian for the super thanks as well as all of these amazing pictures all right now up next we're going to take a look at Marche's haul first and then we're going to take a look at savannah's haul and these pictures were perfect perfect timing because i do want to remind you all about all of the party supplies that we had penny out when we had the huge surprise penny week now these items are still a penny if they did not penny out in your area back in november you might want to double check type in a few of these upc codes and see if these items have now pennied out in your area because sometimes things just happen like that your miles may vary DG may penny out some of these items at certain stores and then two weeks later they'll penny them out at the rest of the stores. You just never know. So if you had some of those items, I know the party supplies uh, were was a kind of a big category for a lot of people and a lot of people said hey those items did not penny out in my area. So let's go back. Let's double check. Here are a ton of UPC codes. Huge shout out and thank you to Savannah. She sent in fantastic pictures with the UPCs. So thank you so, so much. This is the point in the video where I'm gonna jump back just a little bit and I'm gonna clear up that little misconception that's going around, which is all penny items reset back to full price. And that is just not the case. Now I can tell you that 99% of the time, the items that reset back to full price are seasonal 
items. So remember at the beginning of the video, we were talking about the biggest penny list of the year. We had all of our spring and summer categories that pennied out. We had 4th of July, Green Dot, Swim and Summer, all of those categories pennied out. And since then, a lot of those categories have reset back to full price. And those items are seasonal items or dot colored items, but that still leaves us with a ton of other items that are just on our regular penny list, such as these frozen mixed berries right here. I'm still finding these at Dollar General and they are still a penny. But like I said at the beginning of the video, Every single day is penny shopping day at Dollar General. If you stay up to date on the information, if you watch the videos, watch them all the way through, watch those visual videos that I put together, all of those things will really help you out. And once you get into Dollar General, it's going to be so much easier for you to penny shop because those items will literally just jump off the shelf at you. Just last night, I was at Dollar General trying out a couple of deals. I was not even in there trying to penny shop and I ended up finding a perfect harvest candle and another one of those cookie tins. So this stuff will literally jump off the shelves at you. I promise if you do your homework. Now the items that you guys have been seeing scroll across your screen Screen. All of these were surprise penny items and they still are a penny at Dollar General right now. If you want to double check and make sure that these are a penny in your area, you can type in the UPC code on your Dollar General app, but do not trust what the inventory says because all of these are discontinued items. So all of them are going to say out of stock or not sold at this store. Does that mean that they're not at that store? No, it does not. It just means that the system is showing that these are discontinued items, so it's going to tell you that they're out of stock. But you can type in the UPC code and double check to see if they are a penny in your area. And again, if you guys want to go back and check out even more visual videos, I'm going to have that linked for you in the pinned comment down below. So make sure that you go and check that out. All right, guys, so hopefully that made sense and hopefully I was able to clear up a couple of misconceptions for some of you. And if you are new to penny shopping, welcome to our crazy couponing community here. If you have any questions, leave it down in the comment section below, or you can reach out to me via email or Instagram. All of my contact info is in the pinned comment down below. And I'm curious to hear from you all, so please let me know. Who is your favorite college team? Do we have any Tennessee or Alabama fans out there? Let me know down below. And of course, y'all make sure that you stick around and stay tuned because I have three videos lined up for us. So make sure that you do all the things. Subscribe, turn on those notifications, hit that thumbs up button, and leave me a smile down in the comment section below. All right, guys. Good luck penny shopping out there. Thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope y'all have a beautiful day, and I will see you on the next one.